Hi, go see. This is my go see. It's reviewing time. This time, I know everyone already went through the suits, blah, 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 blah. But I have some breaking news. If you go in, actually, I should do it for you. Because this actually broke my heart. Because I thought they were like literally going to come to us. But as the wardrobe item says that they aren't in the wardrobe at all, I knew they didn't exist. Yeah, they're gone. Every single one of them are gone. So that was a massive glitch. And if every single one of you think it, you have to like at least complete these four suits that was in the association store, well, it's either you wasted your coins or that. I don't know how you feel, but yeah, they did. They, they never existed. Okay, they were just there. They was like a ghost. Okay, they were like literally shells of them you know at least we get to review them at least we get to see them you know what they have and what they will cost but sometimes it's like a, it's a gutting feeling because now they're gone and we have nothing else to look forward to in the association store okay soundness aside let's just go into reviewing so this one must be very fast because there's a lot of new suits i need to review so first of all we're going to cello because she's an apple federation we should go in like a circle Okay, so the hair is like not really that, you know, impressive to me. I like the colour, then again, the colour is actually common. But you know what, it's nice, it's messy, um, I just don't really like it. It looks very flat, nothing to it, but I like the colour. The dress is literally one of my favourites from this set. I love the colour to it, I would use it all the time if I could, even though I would. Um, so it gives me that steampunk theme or steampunk aesthetic to it because of the brown gold trimming or bronze trimming and everything like that is so flipping gorgeous and I would like to use it for my aesthetic. I would not use these for the dress or for the theme because they look like what a warrior should wear. You know, the Nikki warriors wear like stockings and stuff so... This should be suitable for a warrior. You know, I do like the color, I do like the detail, and you know, overall, I'm not actually bishing about it. I do love the actual design of them, but sometimes I just don't think it's suitable for the dress like this. The shoes are nice, but they look very uncomfortable and heavy footed. So, if you need more room on your feet, these are not recommended for you. But you know what? They're super nice to look at, but again, it gives me the steampunk aesthetic cello which i don't like how the cello is positioned because it's covering her dress and i'm like dude no can we at least put it here just at least but you know what i like the beautiful details on the cello and um it gives me that nice deep sounded i hate to say this all the time cello and you know they have the most beautiful deep dark soundings to them on their own so i recommend you go on youtube search up the sound of them and you know, trying to look for something that could be really nice and suitable for the sound of this instrument. Flower crown, which is definitely a cr flower crown, there's no gold in it, so therefore it's just flowers. Cool. A necklace that looks very expensive, that looks very mechanic. I love it. You know what? I don't care. It looks very nice on the neck for, for the suitable for the dress as well, so I would like to use this a lot too. The bracelet looks very heavy handed. I mean, look at the size of the thing. That's so massive. But anyway, I like it. I'm not going to bitch about it. Stick is just a stick, so can't really review a stick, can I? Okay, Apple Federation. <laughs> Lilith Kingdom. We have this beautiful, magnificent glory. Hello, my sweetness. She's my third favorite suit. No one can ever beat. I forgot her name. Sugar. No wait, Demon Huntress, sorry. No one can never beat Demon Huntress because, oh my god, the details and the whole demonic look to her. Damn, send me in. Anyway, let's look. Hair looks nice, very childish, messy, but you know what? I'd rather not use this every day. I could use Demon Huntress's hair for this. Dress looks magnificent. I love that purple. I love how dark the black is because it's not that like, not... It's not your typical watercolour black and it's not your typical weak black. This is jet black. This is definitely jet black. So I would like to use this colour normally all the time. No matter how dark it is, but you can still see the details, which is 
You know, artists, you've done the beautiful, magnificent job creating Gothic Orlitas because you have my most appreciative point of your designs. Socks are literally so cute. I would love to use these all the time, even though I am using them on my character at this moment because I love the leather straps to them. Um, overall, I love the design of them. Shoes, oh my god, I'm a sucker for heavy, heavy, heavy heeled boots. Um, but this one doesn't suit Demon Huntress. I tried it like not so long ago and I thought the purple was a bit too cold for the purples that Demon Huntresses use. But you know what, it's not a problem. I still love the design of these shoes and I still would use them. Ornament! Also, my dog is snoring. I love the balloon, I love the bottles, I love the whole aesthetic charm to this. I just find it very cute and adorable. Cute and adorable is the same thing, but you know what, whatever. Okay, bunny hat. Um, you know what, I'm not gonna call her the witch or magic of love. I'd rather call her Mr. Bunny, okay? So, to me and to this channel, she's Mr. Bunny. Don't care what anyone says. So, Mr. Bunny hat is... I know I'm gonna create Undertaker from Black Butler. Because we have a lot of like black, long white hair. So with this hat, I could literally create Undertaker, and he's one of my most favorite characters um, from anime and in general Black Butler. There's no other character that I like him, and with his design or characteristics, he's very unique in his own way. So with this hat, I could literally create him. But you know what? The bunny with the hat is actually putting me off. But you know what? Undertaker could be in many little things. It's a flipping top hat is what it matters. I already reviewed you. Okay, ears. They don't look more like bunny ears. They look very pointed to be bunny ears. Okay. Bunnies don't have pointy ears. They have long ears that's very circulated. Um, so I'd rather use these ears on a um, snow wolf set that we had from the last event, you know, with the war and stuff. So these would be very perfect for your wolf theme, which, hello. I do use that guys, I would just give it to you. Okay, gloves. I could literally use these, but then again, I love my drummer and singer's, singer's gloves from the Starfall event. The jewels, the tightness level to them, nothing can beat it because I love, and those are my typical emo designs as well. If you, if you think it's actually gothic design, I'm staying it's emo and gothic at the same time. You know, because you can't really point out leather gloves. You can't. You just like them. The face. Very adorable. Very shiny. I love the eyes. They're just full of life and light and everything. I just find it really warming. I would like to use this... Jane, shut up. I would like to use this more common. Um, mostly. Okay, her pose. I mean, I love this dress. <laughs> um, but the sad thing is, the ornament with the pose doesn't come separately for the body pose so that's a bit of a like a downfall because you basically be using every item that it requires except from the hair hat ears and face and also we get this beautiful thing i would love to get this i mean i already spent 60 diamonds on this event already just to get the shoes so if i don't get an item from that event every day i would spend my diamonds to get it because I, I think that's where uh, 1300 diamonds come from but yeah, I just love this design and I would use it all the time. Even with Witch Hecate, this could be more suitable for Witch Hecate. You know, I wish me I wish Witch Hecate could come to us. Like really, I wanted to come back. So there's her. Um Cloud Empire. I got an itchy leg. Come on, let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, oh, no, 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 no. Okay, so he doesn't come with a diamond reward, but he's still a nice suit to look at. The hair is very tidy. I could use this for a unisex thing. His cloak is so cute. It's like a half girl, half boy. Because, look, there's a flower detail. I'm not saying that boys can't have flower details in the design. But, you know, I'm not saying they can't. I mean, it's, it's whatever. They could literally pick and choose what the hell they want to wear. So they have my foot for whatever they want to use. And it's like, at the same time though, it gives me like half and half gender 
like theme aesthetic to it because up here is like more of a boyish kind of look and then down here is more like a girlish look and you, but you know what I love the whole beautiful mixtures uh, this looks very cute it looks like a, a schoolboy uniform you know in Japan so <laughs> this would be very very useful if I want to make a schoolboy in Japan even though in Britain we don't the boys don't wear sort, sort of thing like that they wear like a blouse tie shirt and then smart bottoms like this but without a chain or a belt I'm not too sure what the hell they wear but whatever um, but yeah, I would like to use these a lot too. Oh my god. I really would like to get this guy. The shoes look very gentleman-like. I mean, girl, I love it, okay? This guy is very smart. The hat is what's killing it for me. I don't like the design of it. I, mean, I was never a fan of like soft-headed hats, so it's really not my thing. Except for beanies. I love beanies. Um, what is that? A compass? Oh, it's basically a pocket watch. Um, so, yeah, there's a pocket watch. Can't really say much about that. Okay, case. Nice, beautiful. Love it. Face. Reminds me of the guy in the winter from the Time Limited pack. Time Limited? Time Yard Pavilion. Yeah. Fairy. We're almost done, guys. We're just almost there. Okay, so you would expect me to say very girly, very this, very that. You know what? I kind of like her design, but you know what? Just hear me out. I like the hair, but you know what? I don't like the buns to it. I was never a fan of buns, but it's very nice to look at. I love the color that it looks very warm. The dress and the color and the detail of it is most beautiful to look at as well. So, you know, I love the whole tail part and open leg area. So you can see more characteristics in her other than wearing a long gown dress to cover everything up. I'm digging the whole tail part, you know. Shoes, love them, to be honest. I mean, you can't really see them in, with the white background, but you know what? I love them, to be honest. The butterfly, which is kind of like here, I can't really say much special about it. The head ornament, which is on her head, which you can see more clearly. I think it's look very beautiful and soft, and she looks very calm. Her wings, everyone is digging for them. I mean, I am too, because you don't see wings like this in our game until there's a fairy event coming our way. Hello. But you know what, yes, it's whatever. I like the design of them and I love the colour scheme as well because it looks more transparent and then it's not transparent. The face looks very adorable. I mean, she looks so cute right now. And again, with the shiny eyes, it gives me a bit of warmth in my soul. Okay, so her hair comes with the pose, which again, I don't like the bun. And then her body, which doesn't come with the ornaments, by the way. And like, why does our one come with the ornaments? Hello? Um, bottle, which is again very nice, and everyone's digging for it. And that's it. I mean, this flipping fairy looks very adorable, but you know what? I'd rather wait for her to come back in crafts, which she will. She will. Okay, last but not least, the Northern Kingdom, which we have literally two minutes left. I love the hair design, don't care about the color. It's very yellow than blonde, but you know what? I don't care. She looks very cute. Cool. Okay, it's not cool, it's cute. Cool. <laughs> Okay, another leather with high-waisted jacket, which is no waist there. Um, looks very cool, but then again, I would not spend a lot of money just to get her. She looks, I'd rather just wait for her when she comes back in crafts, what well, comes to craft. I am so digging the tail part, like I said earlier, and I love that this top actually has a tail, like, dude. And she has a corset as well, like, yes! You know, I love the whole theme of this. I just, uh, it's my style. Bottoms not really keen off, I don't really like them. I like these, they look very, you know, solid and tight. Hat, I don't really like it, but then my it reminds me of my friend that's into this sort of like fashion, I guess. Um, tie, which is cool. I love to have ties like this, but then again, I would not spend my money on her. Gloves, I like them, but she doesn't beat the stuff or gloves that I collected. Belt. I could use this a lot. I could literally use this uh, a million times if I could. But I'd rather wait for her when she comes in crafts. And also 20 diamond reward. No thank you. And I think that's going to be it from me. Have a nice life.